My name is Savia Sachi Tucker. I'm an orthopedic surgeon at Johns Hopkins. I specialize in hip and knee reconstruction. I work at the Howard County General Hospital. The reasons to undergo a knee replacement surgery are arthritis, fractures around the knee joint, sports injuries, and some cancers around the knee joint. Planning a hip replacement or knee replacement surgery involves careful coordination of several different aspects of a patient's health care. At Johns Hopkins Orthopedics, we specialize in creating a pathway for each individual patient and trying to achieve the best possible outcome for their care. We would start by activity and lifestyle modifications, such as stopping smoking, healthy weight loss standards, to try and optimize patients for surgery. Once they undergo surgery, we have a carefully coordinated team of nurses, physical therapists, occupational therapists, and the patient's surgeon who overlook every single aspect of the patient's care protocol. Prehab or prehabilitation is physical therapy and exercise regimen before the surgical intervention so that patients can bounce back and recover from their surgical procedure with minimal downtime. At Johns Hopkins Orthopedics, in conjunction with our physical therapists at the Musculoskeletal Center in Columbia, we specialize in prehabilitation exercise regimens for our patients that are preparing to undergo surgery so that they can be back at work and back at their sport activities without any interruption. Typically, patients wonder if they would set off metal detectors at airports. I like to tell them that given the amount of titanium that's in a total hip or a total knee joint, it's very likely that they would set off that metal detector. In that situation, I like to give them the operative record so they can show that to the TSA official and undergo the pat down lane to safely proceed to their destination. A growing concern that patients have is metal allergy, especially allergy to the implants that we use in hip and knee procedures. In the hip, the metal is titanium and patients are not allergic to titanium. Some aspects of the knee implant are made of cobalt chromium, specifically nickel. Some patients can be allergic to nickel and we would do patch testing or testing with our allergist to confirm that allergy before proceeding with surgical intervention.